Hello friends! Today we are going to see two different methods on how to use Samsung DeX Wireless without using any external monitor, keyboard, or mouse. Only with your laptop. Let's jump into the video. Alright, let's set this up. First, head to Windows Settings, click on System, scroll down like a champion, and tap Projecting to this PC. Now, hit Optional Features, then View Features, wait patiently while Windows contemplates its existence, and finally, search for Wireless Display. If it's not installed yet, go ahead and add it. And here's the fun part. Be patient. Don't panic if it takes a while. On a good internet connection, mine took around 10 minutes. So yeah, grab a cup of coffee, stretch a little, maybe question your life choices, and by the time you're back, it should be done. Once it's added, head back to System Settings, click on Projecting to this PC again, and voila! You should now see all the glorious options related to wireless display. And follow the on-screen instructions. Now grab your phone, swipe down the quick settings panel like you're revealing a secret menu, and tap on wireless decks. Yep, it's just sitting there waiting to turn your phone into a desktop diva. Just make sure your phone and laptop are on the same Wi-Fi network, otherwise decks will just sit there, looking pretty, and doing absolutely nothing. Now select your laptop name, which gets listed under the wireless displays, and wait for your laptop to give you the permission prompt. Wait for your mobile to get connected with the wireless display and the DeX to get started on your laptop screen. Once DeX kicks in, your phone screen magically transforms into a trackpad. If it doesn't happen automatically, just pull down the notification panel and tap the option to use it as a trackpad. No drama, just a few extra taps. I know exactly what you're thinking. How on earth am I supposed to be productive using this laggy trackpad and zero keyboard input? Well, good news, I've got a hack. You can actually use your laptop's keyboard and mouse to control decks. Yep, real productivity incoming. Just follow the next steps carefully and thank me later. Now, head over to the Microsoft Store, search for a tool called Glide X. Yes, with the fancy capital X. Download it, launch it, and when it asks you to log in, just skip it. We're here for productivity, not paperwork. Do the basic setup and you're good to go. All right, now click on the Unify Control option in GlideX and wait for that magical QR code to appear. Next, grab your phone, head to the Play Store and download the GlideX app. Install it, skip the login drama and breeze through the basic setup. Then tap the QR scanner button. Give it camera permission because of course it asks and scan the code from your laptop screen. Boom, your phone and laptop are now officially in sync. All right, now launch wireless display again and connect your DeX to the laptop. Try using your laptop's trackpad and keyboard to control DeX. If it's not working yet, don't panic. Just press Alt plus R to switch control and boom, you should be in business. Now that we've conquered method one, let's jump into method two and level things up. All right, before we dive into method two, make sure you've got the basics covered. If you haven't set things up yet, hit that little I button above, watch the setup video, and come back when you're ready. Oh wait, well, not really, but you get the idea. All right, let's test things the wired way first. Open CMD from the SCRCPY folder and run the command you see on screen. This will launch DEX over USB, just to make sure everything's behaving properly. When you're done, you can either close the DEX window or hit Control C in the CMD to shut it down like a pro. Now, let's go wireless. Run the next command shown on screen to start DEX without the cable. Once it's up and running, feel free to unplug the USB. Freedom achieved. After this, if you see anything weird popping up on your CMD screen when restarting DEX, just run the command shown on screen to start it fresh. Clean slate, no drama. Now, you can start DEX with the same command, no extra steps needed. 
And that's it for this video. If you found it useful, don't forget to like, share, and drop a comment below telling us which method worked best for you. And yeah, hit that subscribe button for more updates, hacks, and walkthroughs. Bye for now, and I'll see you in the next one.